Right, first plate we're going to take a look at. I believe it belongs to Orion Fleetworks. Is it the one with the red fences? Yep. Oh, that's chicken. So that'll be chicken wild style. And he's got an impressive array of turrets all around his planet. So we're just going to take a pass around each side. My swimming pool is getting seriously close to his planet plate, though. I'm going to have to move it. Oh god, it looks like, yeah, it looks like it's about to fall. Alright, this little trick I'm doing here was discovered by Saber. If you go across, if you go past the plate sideways like this, but you don't actually go over the edge of the plate that you're looking at, you won't be affected by its gravity. So yeah, he's really gone for it with his turrets. I love his ship as well. That ship he's got up there, wow. Okay, so we'll take a little closer look inside. This is where the gravity is going to start to catch me. Oh wow, look at that. Look at a little crane arm which has got a moving, moving area. Some kind of nuclear cambot weapon, not really sure. Or maybe they're warheads, and that's a loading arm. <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised. It does look kind of like that. They look like silos of some kind. It's really awesome though, the work that's been gone into it. You can see a lot of detail. It's really dark. I'm wondering if maybe shadows might make it look better. But uh, anyway, oh, and also let's not forget his dish, which does have logic, which isn't running for some reason. I might have to give the server a quick restart. It's been a, been about a week actually since we restarted it, so that's probably why. Oh, he's been he's used. Is he using illegal blocks? Maybe not. Probably just turn the white light off. I don't know, because there are like pink blocks and orange blocks and all kinds of stuff, which is like you shouldn't be able to get. <laughs> so yeah, love this ship, love the design. I think I built something that looked like it, but much uglier. <laughs> Same sort of configuration with the turrets at the front like that. It's cool. I like it. I love the design of these wedges as well. Here, we're gonna have to get him in for a lineup. And get him to bring this ship in. Right. Let's move on to the next plate. So who is here? Right, this guy started at the same time as me, but I don't think he did any more after the first night. So I guess you could call this some kind of Badlands. Because look at it. It's it's like Minecraft. It's like the prehistoric area. Okay, well, there's not much to see there. There's a lot of buildings. He's copy-pasted. You copy paste them as well. Oh, interesting. Okay, moving on to the next plate. This guy also started on the same night as me. Um, and he pretty much, I'm guessing he must have been busy because I haven't seen him since. But um, he did finish off a load of stuff. And that's his little ship here, the lander. Which he can sit on the faction block as well. It looks really cool. Okay, so that's his. And he's got like a main street. You don't really get the scale of things unless you go right down. And then you can see that actually, look at this. It's uh, pretty big. Okay. So, the next one. Plus nine. We've already taken a look at the artwork inside Plus Nine's house. Oh god. Yeah, don't hit level when you're on the planet. So he's got some uh, artwork in there. And I think someone's left him a gift as well, because he appears to have one of EVN's latest Gundams. Okay, so on to the next one. This one would be... Ah... Uh, Bin Hawkins, I think. So he's got the uh, crystal type antennas. Lovely modular base system here. Very NASA. 
He's got nice little, he's put his paths in between as well, which is nice. And then we've got some kind of vertical thing here. I don't know what this is. Is this a, oh, it must be a gravity elevator. Yeah, off to space. Uh, habitation. More modular units. And up here he's got a control tower. All wedged. Very nice. Oh, I haven't noticed this. He's got a little hangar underground. That's very swish. Okay. And just one, just one. He must have been messing with the uh, copy paste. <laughs> okay. Oh, who's this? Another new challenger has entered the arena. So he's only built this much so far. But what he has built is really nice. That's outstanding. I like the dock, the detail on his docking there. That's really cool. What else have we got? Hmm. What's down here? What the heck is... What? He's trying to make an underground racetrack or something. I think he has made an underground... He's made an underground racetrack. Ah. Woo! Yeah! What now? This guy's made an underground racetrack. You're kidding. No! I'm, I'm doing laps now. Are you sure it wasn't Saber working on that? Well, it might be. But it looks a bit basic for Saber. Hang on, there's not enough turns and stuff, you know? Right. Huh? Okay. 